हेलो गाइस दिस इज अतुल फ्रॉम बी प्रैक्टिकल टेक सॉल्यूशन सो अगेन नाउ टुडे वी आर कम अप विद सम न्यू प्रॉब्लम बेस्ड ऑन द एरेज सो लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड दिस क्वेश्चन सो द गिवन क्वेश्चन इज लाइक वी हैव टू फाइंड आउट द फर्स्ट नॉन रिपीटिंग एलिमेंट इन दिस एरे सो manually if we are trying to find out okay uh, what is the input here is like minus 1 2 minus 1 3 0 so you can see this 2 3 and 0 these are the non repeating character uh, numbers only but what we have to do we have to find out the first non repeating element so this is our first non repeating so it must it means that the 2 is going to be our first non repeating element so we must get the output as a 2 in this case so let's try to understand the logic what we are going to so yes we can use the brute force approach like uh, we are going to iterate over each of these arrays and uh, uh i mean uh, we are going to check that previously whether it is occurred or not but instead of that what we can do is like see as uh, maybe in the previous videos uh, maybe i have told you guys or not so doesn't worry about it so what basically here what we can use is like we can use the concept of maps why maps because see whenever it comes to the uh getting the count of uh, every numbers or the frequency of every elements then map is going to be the easy easiest way in order to work with so let's here also let's try to use the map in order to solve the problem so what we are going to do we are going to put the frequency of every element which we are getting here and also in that map with every element we are going to store the count of that element so once i got all the elements stored inside the map along with their frequency what we are going to do we are going to check that what is the if any of the element is having the uh frequency is equals to 1 that is the count is equals to 1 so it means that that element is not repeated so in that case what we can do is like we can get that element and come out because what we have to do we are not here to print all the non repeating elements what we have to do is like we have to print the first non repeating elements right so let's try to write the code for uh doing so here let me create a function as a public static just because so uh, i don't want to create the objects so public static and uh, let's say it is uh, void uh, so let me write the function name as a get non repeating element <clears throat> right and here i am going to pass the array okay now here what we can do is let's create a map so map which is going to have the key as a integer as well as the value also as a integer the first is going to have the elements as a key and the frequency of those elements are going to work as a value right let's say write map is equals to new linked has map so that uh, it will the way we are inserting it is going to store the data in the same way control shift o to import the package now here what we are going to do we are going to iterate over the array and check that if the element is not present so i will put it put that element into the map and give as a default value of 1 so how we can do that so for int i equals to 0 i less than array dot length okay then i plus plus now here what i'm going to do let's write here what we are going to do is like we are going to check what we are going to check that if the map is not containing the key that is the elements then put the default value that is 1 but if it is containing then increment the same so what we can write it like if the map 
dot contain key contains key and that is nothing but the array of the element oops and what we have to do if it is not present so i just put the not logical operator here so in that case what we have to do we have to write like map dot put here the key is going to be the array of element and then the value is going to be because the element is not present in the map so we are going to call a function called as a map dot get or default so why what happened here like if this element is not present then by default you can pass any value here so by default it will take the value one right but if let's say that it is already present then in that case what we can do here is like map dot put i have to increment the count so array of i and then here if it already present then map dot get array of i then plus one so i have to increment that value that's it so in this way i am able to store all the elements of an array within the map along with their frequency now what we can do is now we have to iterate over this map so how to iterate it using the enhanced for loop for map dot entry integer and this is also going to be integer let's say entry colon map dot entry set so now this is a uh, one of the way to iterate over the map and now here i'm going to check if the entry dot get value i'm going to iterate over each of these values and find out the first element which is having the value one only it means that this element has not been repeated as soon as i got this one what i will do i will just print that value the key related to it that is entry dot get key and after that since i already found the key i will break come out from the loop so now let's run this code and test whether it is working fine or not so what is the name of the function it is get non-repeating element so let me call that get non-repeating elements and here we are passing array so let's save this and run the code you can see here we are getting the output so understand the concept see you in another day thank you